Alan Carr mocked his ex-husband Paul Drayton who called the comedian to complain about his cell during a brief stint in prison. The funny man told the audience at his sold-out gig at the Royal and Durngate Theatre in Northampton how his former partner moaned about the quality of the bedsheets behind bars. The Sun reported that Alan teased, he rang me up complaining, there is a hole in the wall. The blanket's itchy. The pillow is thin. I said it's a prison sentence not an episode of four in a bed. He said how he was worried about Paul being in prison because he has a type. The comedian joked that Paul's type was chubby with glasses, and he said that he was worried his ex-husband might try it on with notorious murderer Rose West. Paul was sentenced earlier this year after he was caught driving over the limit four times last year. The comedian continued, A lot has happened. I got married. You don't read the bloody newspapers it's gone to shit I've got divorced. It's gone to shit he was an alcoholic. He ended up in prison. Paul won an appeal against his 14-week sentence, which meant that he was released early. Following his release he took to social media and said that he took full accountability for his actions. In a statement on Instagram Paul said, As you can imagine, this has been an exceptionally challenging time, but I am so grateful for the support and care I've received. I take full accountability for my actions, but I am so thankful for the opportunity to truly get better and to start my new chapter with strength and determination. Thank you for all of the support, love and kindness you have shown me over the last few weeks. I am now going back to my rehabilitation center to keep my journey and progress moving forward and will be stepping away from social media during this time. Thank you all again. The next chapter is going to be the brightest. Keep smiling lovelies. Alan told Lorraine Kelly on her show how he had to scrap a lot of his material for pre-pandemic as he had written it when he and Paul were still together. Speaking about the split, he said, Oh me and Paul, 14 years. That's a long time. Lorraine remarked while Alan quipped, which in gay years, is 207 years. Do you enjoy reading about celebrities? Sign up for all the best celeb news from the mirror here. He continued, I wrote the tour, and then our marriage broke down during COVID, because it was so stressful. And then I was going on stage and I was just like, well this doesn't make sense, this doesn't make sense. So we're divorced now, as excited about the future, am excited about the future. We're still always going to be friends because we have been through so much together. Celebs at mirror.co.2 core call us direct 0207 29